Hello, hello. Welcome to Emperor's Black Tarot. Today we're going to be doing a reading for you, Libra. If you are here and you haven't done so, please hit the subscribe button. And if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. All right, Libra, I hope you have a wonderful weekend. I hope you have a wonderful week. Messages for Libra. Let's find out, Libra, how you're currently feeling about your relationship status. How is Libra currently feeling about their relationship status? Here. Libra, you may feel like you are ready to leave a codependent relationship here. Ready to move on. Looks like you're ready to move on. How is Libra feeling about the current relationship status here? Six of Cups in reverse. You're not happy with what your person is doing in the relationship. You're not feeling like they are fulfilling you emotionally here with the Six of Cups and being in reverse. On the bottom of the deck, we have the Seven of Swords. So you may feel like your person has deceived you here or betrayed you or tried to get over on you in some way. How is Libra feeling about the person currently, Spirit? How is Libra feeling about the person? We have a page of cups. We have a page of swords on the bottom of the deck. Uh-oh. Could be you, Libra. Are you giving to two people here? Uh-oh. We have the lovers in reverse on the bottom of the deck. So it looks like you guys are trying to make a choice between two people here. And you're wanting to walk away from someone but you find it very hard to walk away from someone. Hmm, you're trying to make a decision. We're gonna let those two pages sit there and get to know each other better, but we're gonna keep going. Okay, Libra scandalous already. <laughs> How does Libra's person feel about them? Let's see how this is going to present. We have death in reverse, page of swords in reverse. So somebody that you are, you can't leave. You guys don't communicate well. But you're wanting to be single here. And I do have this two of wands here, a choice between two. So it's somebody that you're happy with. It's giving me the nine of cups and the nine of pentacles together. Someone that you're very happy with. But there's someone who is, again, not meeting your needs. Here's the choice. Two of Wands. Oh, we have a Knight of Cups here. The Six of Coins in reverse. And the Lovers again. Okay. So now I'm going to have to get specific. Now I'm going to have to get specific. Now Spirit has shown that there are two energies here so let's go in separately okay so this page of wands is fire sign energy that's aries leo sagittarius the page of cups is pisces cancer scorpio let's go in and clarify the energy how does this page of wands feel about libra how does this page of wands feel about libra We have the five of coins, all right? So this page of wands is feeling like you are neglecting them or abandoning them, possibly breadcrumbing them. But it's in the reverse, so that lets me know that there could have been a period of time where you guys, you know, you had maybe a temporary breakup and maybe you guys came back together and you were trying to work it out because I do have this nine of cups coming back out. So this is the person that you are happy with or that you are wanting to be with here. 
but there are still obstacles in the relationship. The Hierophant is in reverse. Man, your spirit guys are telling on you right now. Three of Cups in reverse. Multiple relationships here. And it's stressing you out, Libra. Let's get a few more cards. How does this Page of Wands feel? Oh, man, this is getting deep. Seven of Swords. I have an emperor on the bottom of the deck. So you may have possibly been sneaking around with this person. But this person may feel like, you know, you didn't always give them the time that they were looking for. Or they wanted more time. Okay. It looks like you're trying to make a decision about somebody that you have already been in a relationship with for a while in this emperor energy and you're trying to make a judgment here and then we have a choice between two hmm I feel like the two people are very different between each other I feel like the, this page of wands is very different than this page of cups alright let's keep going how does this page of cups still about Libra. Four of Wands. So they have either they have a family with you or they're wanting to maintain a relationship here with you. You have this Knight of Cups in reverse on the bottom of the deck. So I feel like this is a person that is hurt. It's possible that you were caught sneaking around with this page of wands and this page of cups is 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 hurt over here. Because you were given to other people, Libra. Ooh, okay, Libra. Very rarely does this happen. It's usually the other way around. Your person has multiple people. But Libra today, whoever this message is for, you have multiple people here. Let's get one more card. How does this page of cups feel about Libra? I want you to make a choice. They want you to make a choice here. And I feel like you're not doing it. I feel like you're taking your time and doing it. It's also giving me the Nine of Pentacles for this person. So those are the same two cards that came out before. Nine of Cups, Nine of Pentacles. So I feel like this is the person that you've been in a connection with. This is who you have been building with. You guys may even live together here with this Four of Wands coming out. But it looks like, you know, things aren't working out here. Nine of Cups, Nine of Coins on the bottom of the deck. Looks like you guys need to have a conversation about who you're going to choose here, Libra. All right. So how does this page of wands feel about the relationship with Libra? How does this page of wands feel about the relationship with Libra? They want to be with you for the long term. I have Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles. How does this page of cups feel about the relationship with Libra? They want some clarity here. They want you to make a decision in the energy of this Queen of Swords. And again, this sword is down. So I feel like the decision is not made. They want some clarity. They are looking for some honesty here, Libra. They are wanting the truth. <clears throat> Excuse me. This could also indicate that this is going to be the person that you are again thinking about leaving here. <clears throat> mm, I see lots of arguments. All right, I don't even think we really need to go in and ask about any obstacles. The obstacles here are other people involved in the connection. So let's go in and find out a possible outcome from each of these pages. So we're getting a possible outcome for this page of wands the chariot so again I see you moving forward with this person but I see you trying to avoid a shit show in the process with this tower being in reverse on the bottom of the deck I have the ace of cups in reverse the six of wands in reverse the seven of wands in reverse the Ace of Coins in reverse. And I have Death in reverse. 
Well, I feel like the desire is there to move forward with this person, but you're not leaving. And it's possible that you're not leaving because children are involved here. And it's not so easy to just up and leave because with this death card, it's like I still feel like I have unfinished business with someone. I'm still trying to close out a cycle. My walls are up, though. You know, I'm trying to defend myself, possibly with this page of cups. There are arguments. You know, we're not getting along here. And I'm wanting to withdraw my commitment here. But again, you're not doing it, Libra. What's the possible outcome between Libra and this page of cups? What is the possible outcome between Libra and this page of cups? We have the four of swords. So you're having to take a lot of time to think about this. We have the empress. Again, this can indicate that you have children with them. It also can indicate that you guys have been trying to work things out. You have the four of cups in reverse. You know, you're, you're, you're not happy with this person. You're not happy with the relationship anymore. They just don't fulfill you anymore. And you're bored. You're bored with the relationship. Have the world in reverse. Again, not having good luck in the relationship. Things not going well. And again, unable to close out the cycle. We have the queen of cups in reverse. Being in our feelings after a, a heartbreak, we have the Four of Swords coming out. But again, this is reconciliation energy to me. This is, you know, I'm wanting to move past the, you know, the hurt, the, the disappointment of the past. And I'm wanting to move forward. I'm going to be honest, Libra. It looks like you guys are going to continue to try and work on things with whoever you were, you know, living with or in a long-term commitment with this new person that has come in that maybe you had, you know, an affair with here or that you were sneaking around with, you want to move forward with them, but I don't see it happening right now. I see you trying to work it out with this page of cups, but I still see you continuing to interact with this page of wands as well. This is the three. And I don't see you making a decision. Why aren't you making a decision, Libra? Page of swords. You could still be even lying to this page of cups. But you're not making a decision because you don't know who to invest in. You're confused. Okay, I did not expect all of this to come out, Libra. Let's pull a few tea cards, see what's going on here. Messages for Libra, please. I just saw acting cold and ain't shit. Fed up and ain't shit. So I feel like this could indicate, this is probably this page of cups energy. This person may be, um, they may be tired of, um, it looks like they may be tired of you, Libra. They may think that you, you know, you ain't about nothing. I have ghosted here. We did have this five of pentacles come out. Let's see what hits the board. Messages for Libra, please. Bad karma. Uh oh, Libra. You have creeping. Oh, man. We have given money. And we have player. Mm. Okay, so were you giving this page of wands money, Libra? It's possible. And you have player coming out. That could be your energy and creeping. Messages for Libra. We have dirty offer. That's a sexual offer. Offer for sex. Messages for Libra, please. Messages for Libra. Let's get two more. Messages.
is for Libra. On the bottom of the deck, we have wasting time, stuck, no changes. I think this is you, not making a decision here. Nothing is changing here. We have confused. You're feeling confused here. We have rejected. Someone is feeling rejected. Possibly this page of wands moves in silence. This is that seven of swords sneaking around, being secretive, and we have fed up again. Your person is pissed. Someone is moving here. Someone is moving. And someone is still holding a grudge. And I also have someone losing sleep here. Messages for Leap. Messages for Leap. Messages. We have take control coming out, Libra. Spirit is asking you to take control of the situation and the energy of this chariot. You're needing to make a decision here between these two people. Spirit is guiding you to make a decision. Messages for Libra. You have inner strength. Inner strength. Meaningful coincidences. Ghosted. <laughs> I think this meaningful coincidence is here because maybe you were busted by your person. Like maybe, you know, they caught you. I have runner. And they put two and two together here. This is for Libra. And we have big success though. So it looks like you will eventually make a decision. You have dazed and confused on the bottom of the deck, but it looks like you guys will be able to make a decision soon. All right. I have ship and dragonflies. Ship's about moving on. Dragonfly is something coming to light. So maybe your person doesn't know about this person yet. I don't know. Take it as it resonates. If your person knows about this person, I feel like the breakup is coming. If they don't know about this person, I feel like once they do find out about this person, it's going to be over. We have karmic relationship coming out. That's having resentment, wanting to let go of a relationship, to grow and move on, ascending. That's preparing for a new phase, wanting to grow and move on learning from the past messages for Libra we have keys on the ring that's what this entire reading has been about options having options multiple options to choose from being in an unconventional relationship having one night stands possibly also stringing someone along we have cut down that's about separating, stopping a pattern, and also giving someone the silent treatment at times. Messages for Libra. Twin flames. All right, so twin flame energy is like polar opposite energy. That's where you guys are very different, but when you guys get together, there's like a connection there. You may be feeling that way about one or the other of these individuals, and you have seduction. So there is cheating going on here. Seduction talks about being attracted to someone, teasing someone, hooking up, dating, third party interference. But we have the butterfly card on the bottom of the deck. So that's wanting to grow again to the next phase, wanting to move forward. So the strongest message here, Libra, is that you need to make a decision. 
You need to make a decision about who you're going to be with here. All right, Libra, that's been your message. If you are here and you haven't done so, please hit the subscribe button. And if you like the video, please take a second and give it a thumbs up. All right, Libra, I hope you have a wonderful week and I'll catch you on your next read.